one town at a time. So it's low tide, which means the blowhole isn't blowing at the moment, but it gives perfect access to uh, these great little rock pools here. Local kids know what's up. They're having a great time. It's a, a scorching day today, and that looks like the perfect place to be. We're in Kiama on the south coast of New South Wales. Absolutely lapping it up. I remember the night when I first laid my eyes and had I'm kind of so and I was so strong. So this little harbour here, this is known as Robertson's Basin. It's a completely man-made harbour. That uh, whole area out there in front of me used to be nothing but solid rock. But uh, the locals back in around the 1850s petitioned the government for more parking space for the boats and the like here. Now, as a result of all that stone being quarried out of the ground, uh, it actually started um, what's known as the blue metal industry here in Australia. Uh, basically, what they used all that crushed up rock for was the roads back in the day, which led to a, uh, a rather big influx of workers that weren't traditional agricultural workers in this district. Yeah, harlequin eyes, devilish smile. Crazy beauty 